Hey loungers, what's up y'all and welcome back to another video and welcome to my channel if you are new here. My name is Minx and I am a stay at home mom of five and today I'm going to be sharing with you guys what I put in my two girls Easter basket this year. I have five kids and I have a four year old daughter named Noble and a seven year old daughter named Charlie Rose and today I'm going to share with you guys all the cute little stuff that I found for their Easter baskets. I also want to add I have already posted a what's in my two-year-old son's Easter basket. So if you are looking for ideas for a two-year-old little boy, I have a video that I will link down in my description as well. Or you can go to my videos on my page and you will see that video as well. Now, I know the plan was to do this in five parts, but typical minx shit, okay? I didn't get a chance to. It just, life did not allow me to post as much as I wanted to this month, as much as I needed to this month. So here I am rushing three days before Easter, sharing what I'm putting in my girl's Easter basket. So without further ado, let's jump right into today's video. So the first item that I'm gonna be sharing is an item that both of the girls are gonna be getting. And it is these super cute little bird houses. If you follow me on TikTok, you probably know why I got this. I will elaborate on that in another video. But I got the kids these super cute little bird houses and they come with 22 stickers. You get six paint, like different paint colors, like a little paint um, pod, two paint brushes, and then the bird house for five dollars at target so i got this it is the mondo llama brand so both of the girls will be able to get their own little birdhouse to paint on easter and i'm so excited it's gonna be the cutest thing and we're gonna hang them out there on the tree for our little bird friends next we're gonna jump into my four-year-old's basket first miss noble to know noble is to love noble she is my wildflower child she is my do what it want do what she wants child that's her okay she's four and i got her basket from walmart y'all know i had a whole little easter basket dilemma and i literally had to tell myself girl it's not that effing serious get the kids a basket they're not even gonna care what the basket looked like and that's what i did i am at the end of the easter season going to go get them all the same kind of easter basket but it has to go on sale first because I got five kids and it can be pricey. So here's Noah's basket. I paid $8 for it at Walmart and I thought it was so cute. It's metal. It's like a metal mesh basket and the wooden handle, it just screams boho, chic, and this is me in a basket, literally. And I thought it was so cute. I really wish I would have got all the kids one, but they only had two different colors. And for some reason, I just didn't want to go through that <laughs> um you guys are not gonna see a lot of candy in their baskets this year i usually do a whole ton of candy i actually didn't put any candy or snacks except for for noble in her basket um but other than that we are doing a huge easter egg hunt you guys hear my dog i think somebody's at the door or maybe not um i'm doing a huge easter egg hunt for the kids so they're gonna get plenty of candy easter weekend and i just figured i'm not going to put candy in their bucket i mean their basket so here's nobles here's what it's looking like right now now let's disassemble so i can show you guys what all she got i'm a homeschool mom so i like to get my kids a book or something that's going to get their brain working so the first thing that i got for noble is this little bunny book this says hop pop and play i love little books like this because they kind of like reflect and change as you change the pages and she loves stuff like this it just makes her excited to read so this is just the perfect little book you guys hear my kids like <laughs> i literally only have 30 minutes to do this so let's hurry up next item that i got for my sweet noble and i just hung her little bow on it but i thrifted this super cute little bow i love getting the girls these big bows i'm just obsessed with big bows since they were little um, so she got that bow and then I got her this little jumbo coloring book with unicorns on it just for a dollar at the dollar spot in Target. I was about to say the Dollar Tree. So cute. So we got that. I picked her up some bubbles for a dollar at the dollar spot with this cute little flower on them. These also came from the Target dollar spot. How sick and cute are these? These were also just a dollar. She has been begging for a jump rope and a jump rope is just a fun spring item to have or add into an Easter basket. So I got her this and it lights up if you put batteries into this handle right here. 
So for $1.25, like my girl's gonna be jumping rope, okay? Now my iPhone storage will not let me be great. <laughs> um, so the next thing that I got for her is this little Play-Doh set. She is obsessed with Play-Doh. She can play with Play-Doh all day long, something that keeps her busy. And I love that she's obsessed with Play-Doh because it takes away the time from the screen, okay? So I got her some more Play-Doh. This one comes with like a little container and four different Play-Doh colors. And I thought this would be perfect for her to just sit at the table, sort of Play-Doh away when she's done. And we go through Play-Doh so much. So this is just like the little perfect Play-Doh set for her. The next thing I got is her this super cute little baby bunny. This is by the Crybaby brand. She's obsessed with Crybabies because they cry out real tears. And I thought this one was the cutest little one with the little pink bunny. I mean, the little pink hair and the little teal bunny. How cute is that? She's gonna love that. And then I got this little surprise pack from the Dollar Tree for just a dollar. It comes with five different surprises. Y'all know how kids are about surprises and stuff. The next item I got is her some new Crocs. I thrifted these and I only paid $5 for them. I'm so glad I went to the thrift store because I went to the Croc store for my daughter, my other daughter, and I, they didn't have nothing in her size like the ones that I wanted. So I ended up going thrifting one day and found these for $5. They're almost in brand new condition like be for real so cute and i also got these little gibbet charms from target dollar spot for just a dollar so that she can put them in there they're gonna be so cute crocs are literally the perfect shoe for spring and summer so easy to clean and i love buying them for my kids they hold up so well the next thing i got for her is some more play-doh you get three colors to add to her little play kit her play-doh kit and this was just three dollars i mean a dollar in the Target dollar slot and they smell like different colors. So this one is strawberry, peach, and grape. And it smells so good. And I also thrifted this and it is a little poppet. She loves like sensory fidget stuff. So I thought this little pineapple was so cute. She got a jumbo crayon to go with her coloring book for just a dollar in the Target dollar spot a cute little face mask sheet face mask because we have spa nights and the girls love that y'all i had to change cameras okay um the last thing one of the last items that i got for noble is this little water bottle i love the fact that she can carry it around and at the bottom you can put snacks i also got this for my other kids as well and i thought it was so cute it was only three dollars in the target dollar spot and this is going to go literally everywhere with us this summer and spring and then i picked up this little what is this a, um garden set like a beach play garden set and it's so cute it has like these little scoopers that shape like flowers and i thought it was the cutest thing noble is going to love this for our lake days and park days in the sand and that is everything that i got for her easter basket now i want to show you guys two cute little outfits i'm gonna show you guys her easter sunday dress which is this super cute little dress how cute and it's supposed to feel so good out this weekend so i'm so excited but if it is a little cold they can wear their little jean jackets over it her and her sister literally got the same one because they have to match okay so this is so cute and then we are doing an easter egg hunt party here like i told you guys before and i had to get both of the girls on this this came off of sheen or Shein, and it is so stinking cute it's a pants rumper with these little bows right here be for real so cute so yeah both of the girls will be wearing the same little outfits on the easter weekend on the easter egg hunt and for the easter sunday so i'm so excited about that now let's jump into what i got my seven year old it is obviously a new day but i'm still going to show you guys what i'm putting in my seven year old's easter basket so here's what hers look like i got this from the dollar tree for just a dollar and 25 so that's her basket and then my girl is absolutely obsessed with drawing so she's getting a sketchbook that comes with paints i got this from five below for like five dollars Next, she's getting a new pair of glittery Crocs. And also, she's getting some little Croc charms to go with her Crocs as well. She's getting a light up jump rope like her sister. She got this super cute little purse with fruits on it. I know she's gonna be obsessed with that. She also got this cute little bow. 
I got her this little scratch off activity. She's getting a face mask. She's getting this little SpongeBob yo-yo. She loves SpongeBob. She's also getting a pen board. I don't know if you guys remember these. She's getting bubbles. Sunglasses. A hand sanitizer. So cute, isn't it? She's getting a little surprise pack of her sister too. Lastly, she's getting one of these water bottles and these super cute little Easter glasses. And that is everything that I put in my seven-year-old's Easter basket this year. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Tell me what you guys enjoyed the most about the girls' Easter baskets. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, y'all.